Hello, welcome on Smart Mathematics Pro. So today we are going to calculate the volume of a hollow cube board. So looking at this hollow cube board, we can see that the, there is some space inside here. So this is an empty space in the form of a cube board. And here you can put like liquid or water. So let us look how to calculate the volume of this hollow cube board. Okay, so we are going to consider two methods of solving this problem. So the first one is going to be the volume V will be equals to the base area times the height. So you can use the base area. So this will represent our base area and this will be the height. We can use the base area times the height. So if we look at the base, we have two rectangle. So draw the base. Okay, so let us write the dimension. So if we look here, we have eight centimeter. And this will give us some um, six centimeter. And inside, which is an empty space, we are going to have four centimeter and two centimeter. So if we want to calculate the base area, so the base area will be the area of the big rectangle, which is eight times six minus the area of the smaller rectangle, which is four times two. So eight times six will give us 48 minus 8. 4 times 2 is 8. If we subtract it, we are going to have 40. So now we have the base area, which is 40 centimeters square. So to calculate our volume, we said that the volume is equal to the base area times the height. So now we know the base area, which is 40. So we are going to have volume will be equals to 40 times the height. So the height of this hollow cube board is 10. So times 10. So if we multiply it, we are going to have 400 centimeter cube. So that's it. So this is the first method. So let us look at the second method. So for the second method, we can say we can use the volume of the hollow cylinder will be equal to the volume of the big cube board minus the volume of the smaller one or the cube board inside. So to do that, we know that volume is equal to also length times weight times height minus length times weight times height so if we consider the big cube board so we are going to have our dimension for the big one so we are going to have the length times the width times the height we are going to have 8 times 6 times 10 minus the cube board in internal so the one that will be subtracted or the one that is in the form of a hole we are going to have length times width times height so which is the same as 4 times 2 the height remains the same which is 10 so if we multiply this we are going to have 480 8 times 6 times 10 is 480 minus 4 times 2 times 10 will give us 80 so our answer will still be the same as 400 centimeter cube so this is the volume thanks for watching please for more video make sure you subscribe